The pandemic has certainly taught Atomic Books owner Ben Ray some lessons in patience and perseverance. It's been a series of adaptations. It's been a series of surprises and, uh, uh, you know, unexpected turns all along the way. Instead of lots of customers coming in and out of his North Baltimore business, he's adapted to mail order, free local delivery and curbside pickup. For him and so many others, it's still very tough competition with the big corporate retailers. The balance between supporting and wanting everybody to stay in business and at the same time wanting to keep everybody safe. It's more important than ever to shop at local small businesses you're, you're not you're not just shopping at a bit local local locally owned small business you're investing in whether or not they're going to be here on the other side of the pandemic small businesses surviving on the other side is a very real concern according to maryland based economist aniban basu a lot of small businesses come into this period very fragile financially after a period of struggle for a lot of businesses in march and april and in some cases through the summer unfortunately he predicts a recession again in the next 60 days or so we came out of recession roughly in may i would say that we're heading for a double Deep recession, whether it begins in December or January, your guess is as good as anybody's, but I think that's what's going to happen. Even more reason to shop local, he says. Owners are hoping for lots of support for Small Business Saturday this week, and several organizations like Preservation Maryland are running campaigns aimed at helping small shops survive. In order to make their rent, in order to make sure that they can pay uh, for their employees. Um, this is, a, this is a, a make or break time for a lot of small businesses. My hope is just to get through this, but not just us, but everybody in my small business community and all the other small businesses in the, in the country to get through this too. So as an incentive for the Shop Maryland for the Holidays campaign, several Maryland-based credit unions are actually offering reward points through the end of the year. Reporting live in North Baltimore tonight, Kyrie, WBAL, TV 11 News.